Hey Collective, it's your girl Spiritual Sag. Baby, let's see what's going on for my collective today. Spirit, what messages of divine guidance do you have for the collective? Y'all have been watching <laughs> videos on dyeing your eyebrows. <laughs> Ooh, child. No, not just dyeing them, bleaching them, child. Okay, you know how you watching one thing and then you, you end up on something totally different? Yeah. So anyway, you got the Eight of Swords popping out. What's going on with the Ace of Swords? Ooh. Okay, look at this. This woman is looking in the mirror, right? She's wishing this for someone else. But no, no, no. Okay. Look at her face. She look like, <gasps> she like she done got caught up with something. And then you got the Ace of Swords. So I do feel like something was running people or someone round and round and round. But some, some type of truth came in. Uh-oh. What else, spirit? And then we have, yep, the Ten of Swords. Man. Yeah, somebody tried to do this to someone else. Yes, they did. There could even be spell work involved. With those black crows, this person could be sending spell work to somebody. Okay, but the Six of Swords is here. The same black bird. Look at this, y'all. That's crazy. The same dark energy. See those dark birds? That this woman or man, take it how it resonates, was wishing for someone else. Those same. This is the Six of Swords. The same birds are guiding this person forward, away, away from the chaos and conflict. So this is someone who deals with spirit. They deal with the spirit realm. But y'all know they're, they're, not every spirit is on the up and up. Just like people walking the earth, not everybody's on the up and up. Okay, it's the same thing in the spiritual realm. So someone's spirit guides knew what this person's guides were doing. And they came in and guided this person away from what was headed toward them. So basically, I feel like someone, their magic just it just ain't working. Yeah, someone is untouchable. That someone's a star. It could be an Aquarius energy. Or you guys could be an Aquarius. Look at all them little stars. Like this is beautiful. All right, what else, spirit? This person could have did this in the past with the Six of Cups. This could be an ex of y'all's. This could be somebody you grew up with. They're watching you to see if it works. Page of Swords. And then, like, with this book, it's like whoever this is, they do the magic, then they come and watch you to see if it works. And it's not. And I feel like this person's getting frustrated, but I feel like they're getting caught red-handed. Because the look on her face is like, oh, this person. Now remember, this is what they would. This person could even be doing some type of glamour spells. Mirror magic or something like that, y'all. You could have someone who's obsessed with you. Okay. Eight of pentacles. They could even be doing this on your work. They could do it over your business to try to make your... Um, sales go down, try to make people not, you know, be attracted to you, something like that. Uh, what else, Beard? Now, look, Five of Pentacles. I'm telling you, whatever it was they was wishing for someone else is happening to them. Yeah, because somebody's too protected. You see how this person's holding on to that amethyst crystal? This is the fool. All right, so the other person, their mind game, those same birds came back to taunt them. Dang. That's all I keep seeing is just black birds in, in every card here. Um, It's fucking with this person's mental space. 
Because this, like, look at, you see how the pig is flying? You know how people say you can believe this person when you believe that pigs can fly? This is somebody who lie all the time. It's just lie, lie, lie. That's all they know how to do is lie and play mind games, manipulate. But the same magic that they sent out to someone is coming back and is fucking with this person. Look at it. Just fucking with them. Could be a masculine, could be a feminine. All right. They might even have a mental breakdown. All right, now you got the Ten of Pentacles here. What's this? Ten of Pentacles. It's like somebody wants your business. That's what I'm getting. Ten of Pentacles with the Ten of Swords. Because we already saw the Eight of Pentacles. Somebody wants your job opportunities or they want the attention that you get. So, there you go again. By the pinnacle with the page of cups. This could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. It could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Hmm. Some, someone moves too fast. But now, really, y'all know the Knight of Pentacles is a very slow-moving energy. It's the slowest night in the deck. But to this person who's sending you shit and watching to see if it works, it look like you move too fast, but you're really not. Look how you're walking away. I just feel like something that can't touch you. See that armor you have on behind you? Why they want to do this? That's the real motherfucking question. This could be symbolic to biting the hand that feeds you. Somebody talking shit about you and then they need you or something like that. Yeah, that could also be here too. And so in that case, they're like, damn, you, you know, you shouldn't have said what you said to this person. Oh, because you forgot you needed to borrow $50 or whatever this is, you know. So you got the two of one. Yeah, they need some money. Six of pentacles. Ooh, child, 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 child. For some of you, the person who's doing magic over your money needs money from you. They're literally looking in a book, reading all these different spells to send to you. Okay, but with the six of pentacles here, they need something from you. For others of you, this is the person paying people to do spell work over you. But they don't have anything. They're sitting in the house. And it's empty. This person doesn't have a car. They don't have furniture. We already saw the five of pentacles. They're like literally losing, losing it all. So what the fuck was the point? And so this is someone who will swear that you are doing magic over them when it's their own magic coming back. You see what I'm saying? It shows right here. I see these black birds. <laughs> if you are this woman, you see how that magic going right over your head. And it's coming right back to somebody and it is fucking with them hard. Oh my God, y'all yeah, never seen the illustration like that. The, the birds flying right over your head or going this way, flying over your head and they coming right to this person. Damn. If you look closely on this car, there's a person standing right there on the stairwell. So this is telling me you're constantly on this person's mind. Constantly. This could have been a male who tried to bind you up, make you only think about them. For some of them, they try to make you look, let's keep it a butt. They wanted, they wanted to make you look ugly with the whole glamour thing right here. Could be someone who actually has feelings for you with the ace of cups but they don't have the balls to come to you and say anything or if this is a woman they're not woman enough to come to you and speak about this now you got the knight of swords now that same bird is telling this person finally get off your ass and go tell this person what it is that you want to say and stop sending this fucking spell word 
But wherever it is that they're running to, mm, somebody could be doing this to a Leo or a Virgo, somebody to protect it. Look at that. They're in this ball of protection. So all of these darts that somebody was sending to a particular person is not touching them. And I feel like it's softening someone up. With the, you see the lion, half lion, half man, or half woman, take how it resonate. It's starting to soften this person up. Maybe they're dropping their ego. They know that they got to come and say something to you. The spell work ain't working. Somebody's feeling isolated and alone. This person's also having to go within themselves and ask themselves how they got in the situation that they in. They in the five of pentacles. Well, they got there by trying to do some shit, some fuck work to you. When this is somebody who really care about you. Ace of Cups. Look, can't even sleep at night. Them same birds is fucking with this person. Having sleepless nights. So it's like they need to surrender. See how she's putting her hands up like, I just, I give up. Or this could be a woman too. This could even be with the lovers here. There could be three people involved. One person could want someone else and the other person could want them. Some bullshit like that. So, and, and if that's the case, there are three people involved. There could have been a woman trying to tie up a masculine from... So he would be interested in her, but this masculine's mind is on, on someone else and that person's moving away. And that's also who they're chasing. But for others of you, this was just one person doing this spell work to you, uh, paying people to do love spells on you and shit. That's sad. This, that's just really sad, y'all. Okay, lovers with the star, the temperance. <laughs> Look at this shit, bro. This is somebody who want to be with you. This is crazy. Don't want you to be with anyone else. You got the Knight of Wands with the Ace of Pentacles and the Sun. Yeah, they going through some type of judgment. Look at that. I told you for playing with the magic. Look at this fucking magician. That's sad. That's real, real sad. And this, this look like a man. Maybe the person that he was paying with this Six of Pentacles to do love spells on. Oh, wow. How about this, collector? How about this? And that's what happened. Remember I said there's three people involved? This person, whoever they were going to, to do this, it could have been a friend, right? And this friend could have said, oh, I know how to do love spells. They could have paid this friend to do these spells on you, not realizing that the friend was jealous of you. Oh, Lord have mercy. So she could have been doing spells to make you move away. Six of Swords. This is someone, they got a nose ring, they got short blonde hair, they got fair skin. Like spiky short blonde hair. That person who was supposed to be doing these love spells was really jealous. Maybe they wanted this person for themselves. It's fucking with both of them. Because the masculine didn't get what it was that they wanted. They were sitting there waiting on you to come toward them. You could have been waiting on them to come toward you. And finally, Spirit's just guiding you away. Because all, look at this. It's depicted right here. It was not able to stop you. You, were still, you could still see clearly, still move forward. All of that shit was flying right over you. Because, again, your intuition was guiding you. And so... Y'all are about to hear from someone you ain't heard from in a long time with the Knight of Pentacles. <sighs> yep. This could be a Queen of Cups. This could be like a mother figure or just a water sign. M man or woman. But that's what I'm getting here. They were going to somebody, paying this person to do this shit to you. And I do feel like they did some research on 
this connection or on this person that they were doing the spell work on realized who this person was. But they may have done that shit a little bit too late. Or maybe they didn't. You know, they could have realized. I threw my scoops deck away. But in there it says someone got a tarot card reading done. Um, I feel like, yeah, this person who's doing this um, spell work on you, they realized who you were. And your um, your destiny with the star card. They realized what you were destined for. So they could have tried to take it for themselves. Remember I said somebody wants your work or something? And with the Page of Cups, they could have been lying to this masculine. Oh, yes, I did this. They'll be calling you in no time. They'll be pulling up, knocking on your door in no time. You probably didn't think about this person. You moving on with the Six of Swords. And this masculine could just not be seeing that shit, which is why you saw the Knight of Swords. This person getting ready to chase you. And I feel like those two became really close, 1555. Mm-hmm. She could have been spying in on this fe female's life for this masculine, but she was lying about everything she told this person. It was all lies. You can believe that person when you believe that fucking pigs can fly. Okay. Manipulation with this five of swords right here. Damn. Mm, mm, mm. And let me tell you this. When I say this person was her highest paid client, now he's not paying her anymore. She's losing it. Losing everything. A payment away from losing that home. The furniture that was in it is gone. There's no car. Someone's a payment away from losing their fucking home. She had to keep him stuck. And these rituals or whatever she was doing for him to you were very expensive. And he would gladly pay it. Because he believed that she could do what she was saying she could do. Y'all, this is crazy. So he, like I said, he's sitting there waiting because he just, he's believing that, you know, any minute you're going to show up. She's telling him stuff like, oh, all she do is think about you. And then here it is. Remember I said this person on the stairwell is on someone's mind constantly. You were constantly on this masculine mind and this woman who wanted your destiny. She may have even somehow convinced, oh, hell no, nah, y'all. In doing this spell work and stuff. She may have tried to convince this man that they were supposed to be together. She had this person doing spell work too. She convinced him. Yeah, these people start sleeping together. Oh my God, y'all, let's get the, uh, let's clarify with the small tarot. Could be a Virgo. Someone's ghosting that person now, they're moving forward. Yeah, they're like, fuck this shit. None of this shit is working. Yo has been doing spell work on me. I don't know what the hell you have been doing to my person. But it's not working. And they're going towards this single energy, this earth angel with the temperance, to offer this commitment. What they should have did from the beginning. I told you, knight of swords. Now they're about to go and chase this person. But whoever this is, this is the person that was doing this fucking spell work. They in the five of pentacles now. Best, best paying client is gone. Um... I do feel, for some of you, they, they did. They started sleeping together. Yeah, she didn't, he didn't get what he wanted and neither did she. So like I said, some of y'all, y'all ain't heard from this person in forever. And they just about to, out the blue, come towards you. Yep, <laughs> unstoppable forward movement with the eight of wands. That's crazy. 
Um, yeah, that's what this person's been doing the whole fucking time. Conflict magic. Between the two of y'all. But she's telling him that, oh, these things, they take time. And before you know it, they'll be madly in love with you and they won't see anyone else. This person's trying to take on y'all energy. She wanted your destiny. <coughs> She wanted your destiny. I can't never make it up. The star with the fucking six of wands. Because y'all are destined to be something um, fucking amazing. Some of you guys are entrepreneurs. And I feel like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at it. And now <laughs> they ain't got shit. They ain't got shit. And whoever listened to them, they were great. Listen to this person. They ghosting them. Yep, they don't want to work with this energy anymore. See, magician with the damn three. Of Pentacles, and did not tell you they was paying good money. Yep, she was his best, or he was her best customer. So you go from the fucking Queen of Pentacles to what the Five of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, and the Hermit, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We got Virgo energy here. Yeah, this was someone who had money. Or they just paid a lot of it. They did. They paid a lot of money to this person to do these motherfucking spells. Because this is somebody who really cared about someone. But somebody was lying to them. Fucking them over. And I feel like it was this energy here who was paying all that money. It was the emperor. So like I said, for some of y'all, this woman was able to convince this masculine that um, they were actually meant to be together. Page of Swords, Four Wands. You got two Page of Swords. You see how the masculine's watching this star energy, right? But then you got this person that he's paying, because this is two Page of Swords. She's doing spell work. Because she wants this star. And when, I, when I'm saying star, I mean someone who's chosen. The star card with the six of wands. The temperance, earth angel, nine of pentacles. She wanted this person's destiny. Period. That's why this uh, bird is fucking with this masculine that way. This magic was really fucking with somebody's mind. Now somebody's having sleepless nights. They're losing every fucking thing. And someone's about to run towards you. Okay. Pisces energy four of pentacles, five of pentacles. Yeah, with the queen of cups. Could be a Pisces. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Who this person don't want nothing to do with this energy now. They realize that fucking with this person made their life harder. And with this page of pentacles, I feel like they started watching someone new or listening to someone new. And for some of y'all, like, I don't think this is a reader who's on a platform or nothing like that. We saw the Six of Cups. This was somebody that they knew well. And they thought they could trust. It's like somebody, like a, a, a childhood friend says, oh, I know how to do love spells and you know, that's what I feel. But they wanted someone's el someone else's success. Maybe the other person is really on a platform, star with the six of wands. They wanted that person's destiny. So they're doing these fucking glamour spells, trying to get in this person's dream state. They are really fucking up. And they end up losing it all. Because on this two of wands, two of wands talks about choices. This person's choices left them by their goddamn self. And the one person who was paying them a lot of money, because this damn emperor had the Ten of Pentacles. And he was paying this person good money. Magician with the Three of Pentacles, right? Talking about, oh, I can make this person only see you and only need you. Um, they could have even been doing, like, sex magic over this star energy to make them think about someone. But see, for some of y'all, this is what I feel happened. 
after this masculine realized that the spell work wasn't working, that this other person was supposed to be doing, they weren't doing it for real, for real. They were not doing spells to call you toward this person. Once they did this research and realized you was chosen, they wanted your destiny. They tried to switch your, with your destiny. I feel like he became frustrated and started doing some shit. So there could be times where you get like real horny and you just thinking about this person after fucking nowhere and you're like, what the fuck? That was what this masculine was doing. Now I feel like he's leaving all of that shit behind. None of that shit is working and he's going to rush towards you. But y'all need to know that I'm telling y'all, they was on some shit. They were working together and doing some crazy shit. They were. Oh, yeah. And I feel like because somebody was confused. And so I said this two of wands talks about choices. So this this five of cups and two of wands, someone regrets their choices. It's like they know they should have been came to you a long time ago. I don't even know what the hell made this person get the idea of maybe they were, you know, maybe when this person met you, because that six of cups is who they were doing this with. So it's someone from their past. Either somebody they grew up with, went to school with, could have could even been an ex. Okay? So they're telling this person what they feel for you. Ace of Cups. This is the second time we saw the Ace of Cups. And I feel like this person's like, oh, well, I can do this. Maybe they were doing it in the beginning. But once they started doing research on you and realized who you were, this person, them light bulbs start going off. I can switch destinies with this person. No, you can't, fool. They see it now. They ain't got shit. But the masculine's upset now because he got some type of clarity. That this Queen of Swords or Queen of... I feel like this Queen of Pentacles and Queen of Swords is the same energy. And I feel like they were trying to act like they were a Queen of Cups. Try to switch on, take somebody's energy on. And then try to convince this person that they were meant to be together. This masculine is upset. Because they, they didn't do anything but cause drama. It's like, because of you, because of you. First of all, this masculine can't blame nobody but they goddamn self. Because what he's doing now is what the fuck he should have did from the beginning. He should have just came to you and told you how he felt. Maybe he didn't have the confidence. You know, there still ain't no excuse to start going... Try to have somebody do no fucking love spells. And then they both watching like a fool. Eyeballs big as fuck. Is it working? Is it working? No. Crazy mother. Yep. Yeah, sell my swords. That, that the fuck been taking so damn long. This person is foolish. Child. They is foolish. So then when they would. Oh my God. So then when they would watch readings. They're watching readings with this person. She explaining the readings all backwards, and he don't know. Oh, man. They know now. They know now. As they're fucking heartbroken, but they definitely are walking away from them. I knew it, y'all. For some of y'all, it's someone they had kids with. For others of you, it's like a family member. Or in that case where it's a fucking family member, this person was a hater, five of swords. They just wanted to take on someone's destiny. For others of you, where this person got kids with this energy, again, they wanted to take on this destiny. They wanted this person to want them the way they wanted you because that's all they did was talk about you. Maybe they start saying to themselves, like, damn, you never felt like that about me. You know, this is crazy. This emperor need his ass whooped. All right, six of pentacles. And she started fucking with it. I'm telling you, money, 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 money. And he was constantly giving it up. And we ain't talking about no $50, $60. Child. Because you're dealing with somebody who got it. Ten of Pentacles. And they was doing that shit for a long time. Didn't get them nowhere. Look at that little one rotten ass Pentacle. Didn't get this person anywhere. For some of you, this is either a Leo, because we got Leo, Leo, or a Gemini. They ain't do nothing but get their ass bound up. First card was the Eight of Swords with Judgment, okay? Eight of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, the Queen of Cups, and the Chariot. 
So remember now, I feel like this up uh, the Queen of Swords, Queen of Pentacles was trying to take on a Queen of Cups energy. They're having to surrender because that shit ain't fucking working. And so now someone's having a brand new beginning when it comes to work. They're moving towards their victory and success. Just period. And I told you, let me show y'all what I just saw. That three of one. Like I said, this king of pentacles <laughs> is sitting here listening to whoever the fuck this is. Okay? It's someone who act like they know. They could have even been lying. They could have even been lying. Saying that they know how to do this and that. And maybe they didn't know shit. Remember I said somebody ought to do it? La, 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 la with the page of cups? Oh, man. So, again, that's this person sitting there waiting. They just waiting. Because they keep listening to this fucking liar who says, any moment now, you're going to knock on their door. You're going to call their phone. So, they waiting, waiting, waiting. And your ass is moving forward, period. Well, I thought you said this was going to happen. No, 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 no. And then they're like, well, you have to give it time. Some For some of y'all, it's been three years. Child, how stupid can... Let me stop talking about folk. Let me just get out the reading, okay? Let me just come on about this reading. Whole thing. All of them is sick, sad, and probably depressed some damn well. For real, y'all, this is crazy. This is really fucking crazy. Well, you know, I used to be a, a spellcaster back in my day. When we was in high school, that was somebody probably said to him. I can make this person fall in love with you. You can. Well, it's only going to cost you $1,000. But they'll only see you. Okay. <laughs> Child, what in the good fuck is going on? Uh, let's pull some of these right quick. Yeah, they was attracted to you. You was this person's twin. And like I said, they had feelings for you. Real feelings for you. There's a lot of chemistry here. And I feel like this was at the beginning, at the getting to know you stage, child. But it says your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Yep, this is how they viewed you. This could be the one. True love. That's why we kept seeing that Ace of Cups. But they listened to the wrong person. You know what I mean? You got to listen to your intuition. Ain't no way in the hell. Because like I said, all they did was talk about you. So, if you feel something for a person, just say that. But you're going to let somebody. And I, I do. Like I said, they knew this person. Family, friend, ex, something like that with the Ten of Cups, Six of Cups. So they trusted this person. Child. The whole time they're trying to steal on your energy because you're chosen. Baby, baby, baby. Okay, emotional sensitivity. I feel like some of you guys are empaths. Some of you guys could even be psychic. But Archangel Michael wasn't playing with these fools. Uh-uh. They steady watch. It's working. It's working. <laughs> Y'all, they, they probably got mad when it wasn't working. Mm, assertiveness. <clears throat> I feel like whoever that woman was was so all in your fucking energy. You had to tell her, motherfucker, get back the fuck up. Energetically. Because they was all in your shit. Showing up in your dreams and you couldn't even fart in peace. That motherfucker standing right there trying to send, like, spirits to monitor you and shit. Like, girl, what you doing? The fuck? You know what I'm saying? What else, spirit? Innocence. Yeah, they wanted your destiny, baby. There was something beautiful about what you are destined to have, destined to be. But some of you, you're just a divine feminine, and that's what they wanted. Some of y'all are destined to be a star, Okay. Got the ocean here. Mm -hmm. Changing direction. Told you they didn't have confidence. So because this person couldn't just come to you and say what they felt, they went through all of that. Make it make sense. Make that shit make sense. Now they finally coming. 
Uh, they finally coming with this change in direction because they realized that other person, the shit just wasn't working. And that that person was lying to them, manipulating them, and creating friction between y'all. That, that was true love. So the changes you are experiencing are divinely directed by your newborn willingness to open your heart to love and our guidance. Yeah, because everything that you need is within. That could be another reason why we saw the hermit. They're not just ghosting the other person, but maybe they're going within themselves and allowing spirit to talk directly to them. Because when you're dealing with twin flames, you don't need an outside person to tell you what your twin is doing. Go within yourself and you can figure it out. There's like telepathic communication going on. So they ain't no telling what the hell she was telling this person. And they was gullible enough to fucking believe it. All because this person wanted your destiny, bro. And like I said, this somebody they grew up with. For a lot of you, they got kids with this person. I don't know what the hell made them think that they could trust that person anyway. The fuck? Yes, the trustworthy guidance is going to come from yourself. Go within yourself because spirit is talking to you, masculine, about your twin. Didn't I say that temperance? I said somebody was an earth angel. See, you somewhere folk. Yes, I can't never make it up. Goddess, earth angel, you somewhere focusing on service. And this person, not only did they want to be this masculine's twin, but they wanted your destiny. They wanted your destiny. And this masculine went outside. They said they didn't have to do that, though. Heart chakra spirit said there's nothing to worry about. See only love. Yep, what I say with that ten of cups. Family, either they have kids with this person or somebody that they grew up with. For some of y'all, it was their own mama or mother figure. Child, get the fuck out. Get out. For some of y'all... <laughs> Could have been your own mama who said some horrible shit about you to this masculine. The lesson for his ass was go to the person. Don't be trying to go to this person's family and figure shit out. You know what I'm saying? Like, get the fuck out of here. All right. So y'all think about how y'all going to respond when this person come to you. They just a big old fool. A big footed fool. That's what this person is. They knew from the beginning that you were their purpose and their fucking happiness. But like you said, they didn't have the uh, self-esteem. They didn't have the confidence to come to you and tell you what they was feeling. And what this card say? Just read it. Listen to my intuition in all aspects of life. My intuition. The reason this person couldn't make up their fucking minds because they kept going to everybody outside of they self. Shit. Okay? All right. Till next time.